I want to introduce my friend, Dr. Galbert Kuz. He's the Vice President of Data Analytics and Monetization at ZF Group. It's one of the world's largest automotive parts suppliers, and he's going to give a really awesome presentation. Thank you, Isaac. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Great. Welcome, everyone. I'm going to talk about driving CASE. CASE stands for Connected, Autonomous, Shared, and Electrified. And what we're doing at ZF to actually support the CASE of the future and talk a little bit about how we work with startups and, and what a great partner uh, we are. So let's talk a little bit about uh, ZF. Has anybody here heard about ZF before? Awesome, thank you. So ZF is a, is a global supplier, uh, 36, uh, $37 billion uh, uh, euro in revenue, 230 manufacturing facility facilities. It's a really uh, large company and a very good company to work for. Uh, let's talk about our uh, vision. So we have a vision. It's called Vision Zero. It's around zero accidents, uh, zero emissions. And a lot of uh, uh, our strategies are around that, our commitment to mobility uh, as well. We have four more, four uh, major areas that we focus on, electric mobility, uh, vehicle motion control, automated driver, automated driving, integrated safety. Uh, maybe you saw our first in the industry external airbag demonstrated. And it's all tied together with uh, digitalization and Internet of Things. So every uh, component that we put into the car uh, today is actually a sensor. And it produces very valuable information. And, and my job is to basically figure out how to get that value and monetize it for the benefit of our uh, customers. So let's talk about this, uh, this uh, topic of case, uh, which is connected, electrified, uh, shared, and autonomous. Uh, it's driving many, many changes in the market. It's driving changes around uh, consumer behavior, advanced technologies, new forms of cooperations, uh, changes in business models, and really data. A lot of data is uh, moving around. So it's a great future, and we're all excited about that future, but with that future, uh, come challenges. So let's talk about some of those challenges. Well, we're, we're talking about autonomous driving, connectivity, and shared mobility. So, so we're going to have huge fleets of uh, complexity that we've never seen before. They're going to be autonomous. So, so how are we going to manage that? What does that really mean? Um, there's going to be a lot of privacy concerns. We're going to be tracking a lot of data on a lot of people. So how, how are we going to manage all of that? And then finally, it's expensive. It's expensive to run all that data. It's expensive to have all that connectivity. And what we at ZF do, and this is what I'm going to talk about today, uh, we're really looking for pragmatic solutions, solutions that we can get out into the market in a reasonable amount of time that work in today's environment and into the future. And that's where we have great partnerships with startups. Okay, We're really uh, uh, good at partnering um, I don't know if you've seen a couple of press releases from us on the topic, so, so it's really good. So let me tell you about one of the startups that we have. It's called uh, Kari Wallet, um, and let's, uh, let's hit the video. How we interact with mobility services is one thing, inefficient. As a driver who needs fuel, you fumble around with fueling cards and wait in line to pay. For fleet managers, manually tracking these usage costs is exhausting and those managing fuel stations are plagued with queues and weak fleet relationships. Could there be a better solution? Enter Car eWallet, the first automotive blockchain platform to automate transactions between fleets and service providers. Car eWallet is the future of fueling, parking, charging, and tolling by enabling vehicles to initiate transaction autonomously. Requiring just one-time integration, Drivers simply fuel, touch, and zoom off while Car eWallet processes transactions using blockchain technology. Blockchain guarantees transparency and security over these transactions, preventing inconsistencies. Meanwhile, Car eWallet supplies fleet managers with usage data and simplifies cross-service accounting. Plus, service providers can offer a positive POS experience while growing their relationships with fleets. Car eWallet makes mobility more convenient. Visit our website and contact us today. 
cool. Kari Wallet is located in Berlin. So let's talk about what Kari Wallet actually does. If you look at the current state, if you're a fleet manager, you have a lot of stakeholders you work with. There's a lot of transaction information that you need to reconcile to actually get the full lifecycle view of your vehicle. And it is a problem today, and, and uh, it's going to be a much tougher problem in the future. Because in the future, what's going to happen is there's going to be a lot more service providers, a lot more transaction, a lot more complexity. So when you think about the uh, fleet management software, those monolithic uh, pieces of software that need to integrate every data source and all that type of stuff, uh, that, that's really not going to be scalable. So we need a scalable substrate. And that's what uh, blockchain is all about. I'm not going to get into a lot about blockchain, but it's, it's highly scalable the way we run it as a, as a private blockchain. It's, got, uh, it's immutable, it's got full security, it's fully symmetric. Uh, it's really, as a database platform, excellent for managing mobility transactions of the future. And that's basically what, uh, what Kari Wallet is. It's our approach to managing all these uh, uh, complexities of transactions. We have a strategy to start it, you know, uh, ramping it up right now. And, and that's, a, that's one of our startups. So it, it, as you can see, it solves a bunch of the problems. You don't have time to, to get into exactly how it does, but it contributes to the solution of the problems we talk about. Now let's look at something very different. We have innovated. Uh, we took a, a traditional automotive part, which is a uh, control arm, and we turned it into a sensor. So basically the ball joint, which all of you have in your cars today, instead of just being a mechanical part, it's a sensor. It can actually sense uh, you know, the angle, and we could use that information. We can use that information for traditional automotive applications, like uh, something called uh, height leveling, which is tilting your headlamps to accommodate for the angle of the, of the car, but uh, you can also use it for really cool other things like uh, load monitoring. You can see how low the car has gone. You could use it for road condition monitoring because you can feel all the vibrations from the road in this uh, component, and you can use it for predictive maintenance because you can translate the vibration signals into what parts are likely to fail. The cost of this part is, is actually uh, uh, pretty small, and uh, the benefit of it is, is pretty great. We'll see more about that. It's much more efficient than a lot of other technologies out there in the market. And I was uh, talking about the cost. If you look at the cost benefit of it, it's basically uh, $400 of over two and a half years compared to existing maintenance procedures, okay? So a part that costs $7 in a fleet application over two and a half years generates uh, $400. And again, it contributes to, to the solution. And finally, let me uh, touch on uh, one of our, uh, another innovation which is called uh, the wheel tag. The wheel tag is a sensor that we attached to the rim, and what it measures, it measures the stress on the rim. It also measures uh, vibration, temperature, humidity, pressure, and that allows us to solve some really tough problems. The, one of the key one of them is, again, load monitoring. Um, it allows you to address things like uh, bolts coming loose in a wheel, in a, in a wheel and uh, things like uh, predictive maintenance for certain components in, in the drivetrain. So again, a very uh, pragmatic solution. So when you look at, at, uh, at this total basket of, uh, of technologies that we have, we have Kari Wallet that addresses areas in fleet management complexity, privacy, and helps recoup costs. We, we see the ball joint sensor that helps in fleet management and recouping the connectivity costs, and, and we see the wheel tag. And that's really our approach. We look to get very discrete, you know, tangible innovations that we can get onto vehicles and uh, open uh, for partnerships and um, 
And that's really our approach. So thank you.